Uh, I'm going to do the clothes first before I start doing swatches of lipsticks because I don't really want lipstick on my clothes. No, I've got me uh, keeping me company today here. Yeah? Anyway, so um, I want to first of all show you a pair of jeans, which is just an ordinary denim pair of jeans I got from Oxford Spencer's. These ones you would have seen, I bought them two years ago. These ones you saw on my video when I was in Manchester, what I wore in Manchester. Um, love them, still wear them a lot. They're, they're slightly stretched and lust stained. I described them in my blog, interestingly, in 2017. I described them as sort of getting used to the high waisted again. That surprised me. I thought we were getting used to high waisted now. I hadn't realised we were still we were getting used to high waisted two years ago. So um, anyway, good value for money. Going to last me still a long time, especially as the high waisted. Um, so yeah, that's a pair of pair of denim jeans. On the trousers and jeans front as well. Do you remember two years ago, the colour of the year or the colour we were all wearing was flame. That was really nice, vibrant, rusty red. And um, uh, we saw it everywhere. It was on coats, it was on trousers, on skirts, it was on blouses, it was on TV. I saw it. I, I showed pictures on my blog of people on the platform wearing it. I saw people on TV wearing it. Anyway, I bought myself a pair of trousers at the time. Flame! Um, not Fame, not that program, Flame. And uh, these are Sainsbury's, nice little zip feature at the bottom here. Uh, wore them a lot, wore them last year as well, and will wear them this year too. Love them. Sainsbury's are good quality, in my opinion, for jeans. At least were when I bought those, so I assume they still are, just like Marks and Spencer's. And also, now on the top front, I bought a lovely t-shirt that I really liked from TK Maxx. In the UK, it's TK, TK Maxx. This is Calvin, Calvin Klein. It's one of the special offers at the time. It was at the front of the store on a special stand. Just, just these t-shirts. Um, really good quality. Really like that t-shirt. It was good value. And um, that's Calvin Klein logo. It's got a good shape to it. And I've worn it a few times. And I will still continue to wear it. And I bought also, in those two months... June and July last year, I bought this top from Sainsbury's um, made of what I used to call, I don't know what it's called now, um, a sort of um, cheesecloth. It's not quite linen. It's what I used used to call as a, as a child when I was in the 70s. It's called a cheesecloth type material. It's a bit boho. It's got lots of details. It's got some sequins. Really pretty. A um, bit of a waist detail there. Floats out. These sort of sleeves that um, get a bit wider. And really love this top, worn it a lot, but it's cold shoulder. And so though I wore it last year and I wore it the year I bought it the year before, I don't know if this year cold shoulder, shoulder's a bit passe. I don't know if we're still wearing cold shoulder. If we are, I will wear it because I love it. Um, it's a shame because if it was short sleeved somehow, I would, you know, I'd wear that. It's just the cold shoulders. The cold shoulder gives it a feature that will at some point date it. It's not classic. With all these, these are all classic, aren't they? Um, so that's a bit of a shame because it's got such a lovely design, but it wasn't that expensive. Sainsbury's too. But don't do Sainsbury's. Sainsbury's do some beautiful things. Absolutely beautiful things. Just keep your eye open for it. So I bought those four things, still got them, love them. I also bought, at the time, lipstick. I had just discovered well, lipstick mad, actually, because I had just had a root canal on my tooth, had um, internal bleaching to whiten it because it was had gone grey. And um, having a new sort of teethage, toothage and so on, I'd had braces as well. I was um, discovering lipsticks. I discovered these two lip stains from Kat Von D. One, that one is Double Dare. And that one is Lolita 2. Um... If, I'm not going to swatch them because the, the swatches just come out the same colour as that, actually. And the double dust slightly plum, Lolita 2 slightly brown. Still got them. And I had forgotten I had them. A bit like other things, I, whenever I've done one of these type of videos before. Rediscover things, don't I? Um, they're still good in the tube. And I've put one on now. I've put on Lolita. Um, I... Will re will start wearing them again because honestly the longevity, I mean obviously they've lasted two years so they're longevity, but on the mouth once you've got it on the longevity is phenomenal. 
So um, I think they're more autumn colours. I'll probably wear those in the autumn rather than summer. Um, but I've got to remember to do that because they are they are good good winter autumn winter colours. I think. And another lipstick I discovered at that time was Deep Rust by Boots Number no. Seven, which is still available. Those two are available as well. I think they're available on Sephora and in, in the UK in Debenhams online click and collect um, and this is this is uh, this is if you can see it um, that is called deep rust by boots number seven number seven I love it love it it's still available I still got plenty there I really must use it again I think that's more of a um, that's the color let's watch it I think that's more of a a uh, late summer colour, really. This, in, this summer here, I want to be wearing the, the corals and the soft pe and the peaches and so on. So yeah, I'm going to have to put those aside and remind myself to use them late summer, early autumn, and the Cat Monty in the winter. Um, anyway, sorry about where I well, No, I'm not going to apologise for how I'm sitting. I thought this would be cosy, just curl up on the settee and talk to you. Um, and also facing the light, which is better too. Um, I'll just wipe that lipstick off my hands. I don't want it on my clothes. And I hope that you found a little chat through what I was wearing and buying and um, makeup on my lipsticks from two years ago. Uh, interesting. And I'll catch you another time. And if you enjoyed this, subscribe.